I feared that the children inside would be forgotten about. And I thought, um, well, what can I do? And uh, the one thing I know that I know how to do is to come down and be in a place. So here I am, and I hold up a sign, and I hope that people start paying attention that, that those children inside don't get forgotten. My main concern is just that they're there for, for way too long. Um, um, the, 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 the idea that they're there, you know, as a, as a kind of part of a placement process is kind of ludicrous when there are people in there doing their best to, uh, to, to prevent placement. The average stay in there is over 50 days. Uh, the Flores decision says that 20 days is enough to, d to really be damaging to a child. These are children, and uh, 50 days is bad, uh, 60 days is worse, 90 days is worse, 150 days is worse. All these things are happening, and they're going on in there. Well, it's pretty impossible to get information. I, I, I infer most of what I, what I learn. I watch what goes in, I watch what goes out. Um, I occasionally get a word from, uh, from an employee who, uh, who dares to talk to me, but they're all instructed not to talk to me. We want to visit the children. I understand that, yes. sir. Uh, let, let me explain. I, I just want them get... to know that we're here. Absolutely. And people have come from all over the country. Basically, we've simply messages okay. of love all right. and hope. Yep. And just want to make sure that the kids have a chance to hear sure. that. Absolutely. And I understand yeah. that, sir. And we, sure. They definitely would appreciate that, as we do as well. Once I thought to write a history of immigrants in America. Um, they're so proud of this place. I just don't understand why they're not willing to talk and tell, tell me what's going on inside. They think it's so good.